I just binged the hell out of the new Twisted Metal series on Peacock. Let's talk about it. This is my spoiler free review. The story follows Anthony Mackie's character, John Doe, in his day to day life as a delivery driver in a post apocalyptic world where good people are few and far between. People are just different levels of shitty to each other, and their shittiness commonly causes all kinds of different combat scenarios and dismemberment. The show has some pretty gratuitous violence, so it might not be the best thing to have your kids watch. It feels like Peacock's answer to Amazon Prime's The Boys. So what did I think? I thought the show was pretty alright for the most part. I was a pretty big fan of the games as a kid, but I didn't have any expectations going into the show. The show was definitely entertaining, and if you're planning to watch it because you were a fan of the games as a kid like me, just hang in there. The stuff you want to see is here. There's great vehicle combat throughout, but if you stay with the show long enough, you'll be rewarded for it with plenty of cameos and Easter eggs and callouts to the video game. Sweet Tooth was definitely the most iconic character in the video game and he's all throughout this first season of the show. He's definitely a standout here and he's the cause of a good chunk of that gratuitous violence that I mentioned earlier. Then the way the season ends leaves us with a great jump off point for the next one. My main gripe with the show is just how long it took for it to get to a lot of the stuff that I wanted to see. And it got dry sometimes, but the show is mainly funny and snarky throughout. And Anthony Mackie's character was just a little bit unlikable because of his smugness. Video games are having a pretty exceptional year as far as adaptations go, right? First, there was The Last of Us, which was fantastic. Mario was great. Gran Turismo was a lot of fun. And then there's this series, which was a lot better than I thought it was going to be. I'd definitely watch another season. So let me know what you thought of the show in the comments. And be sure to subscribe to my channel so you can catch my next videos. Be on the lookout for my review for the upcoming Star Wars Ahsoka series as well as my preview for everything dropping in September.